people I'm back again with another new what if and this is a request what if well that's actually first for my channel cuz nobody previously before that like requested a new what if idea they requested like parts of a what if yes i'm going to have to like upload what if deku had the power of avatar part 3 i haven't forgotten about it i will soon somebody requested part 3 for it but this is the request what if and that is what if deku is captain america by classified no sequel thanks buddy this goes to you okay i hope you subscribed and and if you have any critiques or if you have any like new ideas like these cuz you gave me like a bunch of ideas i'm going to do all of them don't worry okay i did some of them I haven't finished them so i'm going to continue them too and i'm going to do like the new ideas all of them okay so don't worry about it uh, but thank you very much man this is your host and dost kranti again with the new what if and that is what if aka deku izuku midoriya our boy the chad deku is the captain america part 1 let's start okay so essentially uh, our what if starts like the like the normal times timeline what if essentially deku is found out that he's corkless so he can't have a cork so he like when he's like four he get diagnosed that no he doesn't have any cork so it's like he's really really sad and like mama midoriya is really really sad but deku still wants to be a hero he wants to like protect the people and protect like he still has like his inspiration is still all might by the way he's not going to get all for one in this what if cuz if i give him all for one that's just going to be like with the captain america super soldier formula with all for one that's just too op that that that's not going to be our deck okay so i don't know who am i going to give the all for one to uh but let's see okay this is the first part so i'm not gonna like dwell on that okay so let's go so essentially uh deku like is like becoming like uh really really sad he's corkless and like bakugo teases him and bullies him like you know like he does because he's uh d-i-c-k yeah he's like a pompous prideful d-i-c-k and a bit of a narcissist douche bug yeah <laughs> yeah so he's like that so uh deku is like uh so deku gets bullied a lot but he's still like our like the mcu version of uh steve rogers like the movie version because i i have also have read the comic but i i like the mcu version like the chris evans like captain america better because he's kind of have like a heroic thing going for him okay and he still like stands up despite being like weak and frail and corkless in this society he still stands up for what is right and what is truth and what is justice oh crap that is um, a superman that's not captain america <laughs> but nevertheless he stands up for the little guys uh, who bakugo like bullies he stands up for them and he stands up for himself despite being the little guy and the weak guy and even the guys that like he stands up for they like say it like why do you do this buck why do you why do you do this deck uh, izuku why do you like constantly put yourself in the harm's way to get bullied by bakugo again and again please do not do that but deku our boy deku says that i do this because this is the right thing to do and i really really hate bullies yeah true mcu fan knows where i get this line okay <laughs> yeah hashtag captain america part 1 the first avenger movie yeah okay so essentially yeah so he grows up to be like a little bit like steve rogers the skinny steve rogers oh shit he's like small might isn't he oh yeah he's like small might 
skinny uh, let's just call him skinny steve rogers he's like he has a body frame like that but he's like extremely intelligent like our deku and has a very tactical mind like our main timeline deku so he's like not gonna be all just like 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 brawn he's also gonna be like smart like really really smart like his iq is like up the like chart he's smart not nezu smart but still very very highly tactical and analytical and very strategical mind in terms of like combat or in terms of like how deku is okay so yeah about that so it's kind of like that so uh how he gets the super soldier sir so essentially uh the government like in this timeline the government of japan is like like they're like giving pamphlets yeah we're just gonna do it like giving pamphlets like there's like a, a experiment for like enhancement it's like a enhancement of core uh, enhancement to make like a better let's just say like a like it, it's, it's just kind of like core okay in the my hero academia season 3 you have seen like uh, the the sword villain or the um, Oh yeah the sword villain that Kirishima stops with like our boy Kirishima stops he uses like a, a like a cork a, a, like a cork enhancing something stuff yeah he uses like a cork cork enhancing uh drug yeah he's uh, like they're like giving pamphlets like that but they're instead of cork enhancing the pamphlets is going to be like it's going to give you like new cork or like uh like like it's going to give a mutation to make you a cork so deku him being the desperate kid he is wanting to be hero he like signs up for them and signs the waiver from that if anything happens in this uh why can't i speak english today oh, sorry about that if anything happens in this experiment in the experimentation and the pharmaceutical company and the lab and the scientists will not be held responsible for the subjects that paralysis or any kind of thing blah 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 all that crap so he signs that waiver and he like so instead of like in the original what if like the scientist abraham i don't remember his like last name but his name is abraham the german scientist who like gives him like the uh, super soldier f- Uh, formula so it's it's gonna be like him yeah it's gonna be like him and he like uh, injects him with the super soldier formula and the gamma ray the experiment is gonna be kind of like uh, like yeah it's gonna it's gonna be kind of like uh, yeah it's gonna be kind of like um, captain america movie one yeah it's gonna be kind of like captain america one but not that intense because there's no like tony stark if i put like tony stark in there i'm gonna have to make avengers howard stark uh, it's gonna get two out of hand i can't do la- that much scripting i can't build it like a uh, who am i gonna give the iron man suit to bakugo hell no he already has proportion yeah oh that's a cool idea what if bakugo was iron man yeah and he was corkless yeah that that would be cool okay so essentially like that so he gets a super serum formula jacked up like uh superhuman speed superhuman like uh, high mobility high region like a uh, little bit of strength like you know like captain america uh, like the falcon and the winter soldier program uh, winter, winter soldier tv show from marvel you can see like uh, there was like bunch of super soldiers like riley yeah it's kind of like that it was like really really strong and really really good so and the scientist tells him that it is not the serum or it is not the power that makes a great hero it is what's inside every person the heart that makes the great hero and you my boy had that heart that is why i chose you and so essentially uh, the scientist says that and he gives him the shield the vibranium shield that he gets oh i have to put howard struck uh, howard struck me okay instead of howard struck in this what if that scientist made it made the uh, shield for him so he gives the shield okay to him so it's my what if okay blah 
what can you do it's my what if yeah it's my i'm the like the dungeon master of this what if yes <laughs> so he makes the he he gives them the shield and like deku wears it and deku like trains it with it and one evening like uh, like the scientist is like instructing him how to use the shield and how to like what capabilities he's like they treating and in this instance do you remember like uh, overhaul the 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 chi the yakuza they wanted to like take the t- take the professor and his formula to them in order to like use it for their benefits you know cuz yakuza's like they have already have like something like a cork enhancing stuff and like cork dampening stuff from yuri so they're gonna like now they want to like make cork like like uh, individual people who's not corkless they, they they're gonna like make them cork or they could like add multiple corks onto them so they, they are, are enhanced their cork so they wanted to essentially control meta human and like corked in- individual so uh, yeah the scientists like won't let them have it the yakuza and the ch kai yeah i don't remember like overhaul yeah overhaul is the head of the nation and he's like a, he's not the boss of the yakuza but he's like a middleman he's like a um, he, he's not boss yet so essentially like that and he like he attacks the laboratory and the scientists and deku is there and but like the yeah then scientist gives one vial to deku the formula to deku and gives him a usb sticks a usb stick how to like recreate that experiment he gives that to like deku and he destroys everything else and he tells uh, he tells deku to go away from this lab and he will take care of this and he blows himself up along with the lab because he knew that he if he is taken none of like if he even if he all the research that he destroyed is worthless is pointless because in his mind they can like uh, get the information somehow there could be like i, I don't know because in this universe they have like a bunch of corks they could be like mind reading corks or like uh empaths who can influence their actions you know some x-men shit yeah they're like professor xavier's kind of meta human so he just straight up like committed suicide yeah along with the spread and deku is like no i swear on you that i will be the hero that you thought of me i will be the greatest hero who will protect this world so essentially before deku meet all might met all might or the slime villain or he is like enrolled in the ua he already knows about the yakuza and the and the metal liberation army stuff because the scientists have been con- the scientist was contacted by them so he has an idea of them like that they exist but he doesn't have the idea that where do exist where do they exist and how many people they have or who are the leaders of those organization but he knows the existence of those organization like compared to our normal timeline deku so he kind of has a advantage over them knows how they operate but he doesn't know which are the main leaders or where are the situation and the, and he also knows about little bit of league of villains everybody knows about league of villains because uh, yeah everybody knows about it so yeah it's kind of like that so essentially so essentially like deku is like uh, he will arrange that and like over the summer break so that's the last day of school and deku had some muscles yeah he had some bulk to it and he was like and bakugo and along with like his classmates and his bully didn't want to bully deku anymore cuz he looks like like he kind of looks like 5 foot 8 cuz he's still a teenager i'm not going to make him 6 foot <laughs> and he's japanese it's not like european yeah <laughs> cuz genetics That's a weird thing to say. Okay. By the way, I myself is only five foot ten, I'm not six foot. <laughs> I'm not American either. I'm Bangladeshi. <laughs> I live in Bangladesh. Yeah, you can probably hear my 
Desi accent from uh, the way I speak. Okay, so he essentially like uh, it's the last day of school, and the teacher is like, "Oh, I know what you're gonna do. You're all gonna go and become hero." And he throws the paper and all that crap, and everybody's flaring the cork, and then. Uh, he says like oh i can see that bakugo is applying for ua so is also deku cuz deku is applying cuz he made a vow to himself that he is going to become the best hero that he can be so that he can avenge uh doc scientist abraham like doctor abraham i forgot his last name okay but i remember that his name is abraham something cuz he is like uh, yeah cuz he like impacted a lot cuz he chose deku cuz he saw the goodness within the deku the heart of the hero which all might saw in deku in the original timeline deku was always a hero in his heart but he never had a cork but all might gave him a cork like that the scientist gave him superhuman like ability like captain america ability he gave him a super soldier ability and deku already had possesses like a very high intellect and very high like iq battle iq and strategy so yeah it's kind of like he's kind of like a very 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 young version of captain america the reason why i said very very young version of captain america cuz if you don't remember captain america was frozen in sc- uh, ice for 80 years so is like over 100 years old and deku is like only 15 by this time so yeah he uh, like finishes school and baku doesn't like uh, throw gets his notebook and doesn't throw it like that instance doesn't happen cuz deku is little bit bigger and little bit intimidating so he goes to his home and he's like going through the sci- uh, like the shortcut and the slime bill and uh, like being all petto uh, he comes to deku and he's like tries to attack him and he's like hey kid give me your body oh yeah uh, yeah sorry <laughs> he's like hey kid give me your body <laughs> Give me your body now. Ah. So Deku is like, "Oh, creep you, 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 you." What's the right word? Ah, why am I forgetting English today? Sorry about this, guys. Sorry about this, guys. Uh, is uh, you pedophile? So he essentially like escapes, like because he has power, he escapes that. like slime slime villain he doesn't all he doesn't have the strength level of like all might he just has like strength level of like uh captain america cuz he's gonna be captain america so he is captain america so like the slime villain is try try to uh, is trying to attack him and he's like evading and dodging and he's like okay he's slime so if i like splash him with water his body will be like his body's shape reduced little bit so he like uh, was bobbing and weaving and it was under a bridge so like the slime villain was like constantly attacking him and deku like jump high and like did a big giant cannon ball like on the uh, cannon ball on the water and it splashed the slime villain with water making his body like more liquidy so he cannot like move that fast like he used to so yeah all might comes and is like oh that brilliant thinking yeah young boy that that is amazing then he like puts him back on the bottles and deku is like thank you all my thank you for saving my life it's an honor to meet you yeah, he's going to have a little bit of like captain america personality cuz why not he has like captain america is very righteous person so deku uh, then all my is like uh you did good but do not but, but you seem really powerful like you're natural strength is powerful uh, what kind of cork do you have kid i said uh, and then deku said well i'm corkless actually but i have uh, enhanced strength and enhanced speed and enhanced superhuman like everything because i was experimented and alive and i was like so you are a meta you're like a super soldier i heard about that program i know about like my friend uh, scientist david chill yes that's the movie i'm adding in with that too my scientist knew about like professor uh, doctor uh, professor doctor abraham i don't remember his last name again sorry ah uh, his last name became i don't remember his last name uh, doctor abraham and he was a good man i'm glad he chose a wonderful kid like you it's a shame i never met him but take care 
and and Deku is like uh, asked All Might, since I'm not an original like corked human individual, it is my mission that I want to avenge him and become the symbol of peace. Do you think I can do that? And All Might says that with hard work and determination, you can do everything, kid. And I believe in you. And I've seen you in action. You just need a little bit of training and your limitation and your strength. And you will be a wonderful hero. One of you can even become one of the best. So uh, All Might's like jumps and he goes and like Deku never clings onto his pants. So just accidentally All Might just drops the vial of the slime. Okay, we're not gonna do it like Deku. Like he's gonna like uh, like he's gonna steam out and he's gonna become small might no we're not gonna do that okay just accidentally drops it and like um, it attacks Bakugo like the regular timeline and Deku like sees smoke up in the air and he, he can hear like screaming and he can like hear like people screaming kids screaming like help help why aren't the heroes doing anything and he's like okay must protect everyone must protect everyone because he has Captain America's power so he like like moves really really fast and he goes there and he sees that Bakugo is stuck there and then he's thinking why aren't the heroes doing anything then he just like zones in and goes up there and this is where we're gonna left of the what if this is your host dost kranti signing off tata bye goodbye and i love ya oh by the way one tidbit thing if you have i like messed up a lot in this what if because i'm really really thirsty like really really thirsty and it's really really incredibly hot because i don't have any conditioning in my room so i just have to like turn off the fan when i record this yeah so and it's like the temperature today is like approximately like 107 degree fahrenheit at night i don't know about what's the celsius uh, like constantly walking like constantly talking with american people i can't like do do your math it's 107 degree right now and i'm like in a room all the windows are closed all the doors are closed no fan no air conditioning i'm sweating like a lot so please bear with me <laughs> i messed up a lot and for some reason i was forgetting english how to say english which is weird that never happens to me and if you so, so please if you like it uh, I would very much enjoy it if you could thumbs up give it a like comment if I have if you have any critique or any ideas and please share it with your friends and families and if you like it you can listen to it again and again and you can listen to other stuff I also make like music like ambient stuff yeah like chill music ambient stuff sometimes even metal sometimes even meme sometimes even vocal covers too yeah you could like i sing also if you do not think i can sing then check out my channel's playlist please see i can sing yeah you can listen to all of that check out all of them and uh subscribe if you like my content because I'm bloody weird. I make music. I love anime. I make anime what if. And if I have little bit. Uh, my gear nowadays sucks. If I like get some good gear. Like a little bit of better gear. I'm going to uh, cover some like anime musics. Like anime themes. Anime OPs. Anime end theme. Like anime opening theme and anime end theme too and like anime theme or instrumental in general because I love music in general and I also love anime it is my dream to become a composer for an anime so if you guys like making any short animation or stuff like that hit me up I will work for free I will become a composer because that is my dream because I like the love of music came to me because I watched a lot of anime when I was a kid yeah so this is your host and those Kranti 
signing off and I'm babbled for a long in like sweating constantly a lot not a good experience <laughs> in 107 degree Fahrenheit windows closed no air conditioning no fan not a good experience please like share and subscribe and the last part where we left off like the sludge villain attacked Bakugo and like all the super he all the heroes are like uh, scrambling around and they couldn't like do anything and like there is small might and he ran out of steam and Deku like heard the s smoke he's no he can't hurt the smoke he heard the noise and screams and he also heard like uh, like the noise and he also could smell the um, ash and like burning stuff on the air then he like like totally like rockets off there yeah he doesn't have any flying cock or anything but he's like literally like goes there and like runs there and it's like he he's like he's doing it like really really fast and he's he's going there and he's like holy he's, he reaches there and he says oh Bakugo you're you, you're like you're like Bakugo is in the uh, is in the sludge villain but nobody's doing anything and then like literally like without thinking nobody's doing anything he just like he goes up to the sludge villain and like goes closer to him I don't like bullies like the iconic line from Captain America yeah I don't like bullies and he just goes there and he like tries to fight the uh, sludge villain and he, he's like he and they're like going like around and here around and around and there and they're like really like i mean he can't like attach it because he doesn't have any destructive power like all might does but he he is like a super soldier yeah he's gonna he, he's gonna have some training he, he's gonna learn some assassination from somebody in the future that's a that, that's that's like that's like a big big uh, secret in the future yeah so he's gonna go there and he's like can't do it and literally like the sludge villain is like uh, yeah like throwing him uh, again and again with his like slimy tentacles yeah sludge villain has sludge tentacles in this what if yeah he has this oh sorry my girlfriend just texted me uh, babe not late not now later yeah so he like get like uh, he's like um, thrown down like everywhere and Deku like picks up like yanks up a car like like a car there's like a nearby car and he like he, he he gets like flown towards the car and he breaks the car and he like severely damages it and he's like oh, god I have to get through like I need some big metallic object so that I can like like go toward him while defending myself and his tentacles wouldn't hurt me i just need something to block or parry his attack then he like sees like there's like a car like door there and he picks it up and he uses like the shield yes like the captain america first like like the first captain america movie he picks it up and he like he like the sludge villain attacks him again and again he like uses the car door uh, like like a shield and he goes like and he like blocks it he like swats it away his par he parries it and then he like throws the car shield towards the slime villain and slime villain like, oh crap this like a gigantic cloud no then the the slice is the, the slime villain like it literally like cut, cuts right through it and the slice villain is like on the air and he like jumps and like literally grabs Bakugo and gets out of the slime the, the sludge like goes through it and he gets Bakugo on his lab and he's like he's like all chiseled and, and then and they're like oh Bakugo is oh, oh, thank you <coughs> Thank you, <laughs> because Bakugo is suffocating, and everyone's like, "Holy shit, who's this man?" Yeah, and the and he the sludge villain is like, like, uh, his his body is he. Uh, I need your body, and he goes to him, and uh, then All Might comes, and All Might like, Death Row, it All Might like, 
gets like inspired by his heroism and he gets some big motivation and he like detroit smash and he creates a huge tornado and that's how the sludge billion like goes away and everybody is like uh, praising baku like oh, kid you're pretty damn damn tough come to my agency and stuff like that and he's like they're like scolding like hey you're not you're not a superhero why did you use why did you well why did you risk your like uh you don't you're not a hero why did you risk your life and why didn't you use your cork and then deku is like well i don't have one i'm a I'm I'm a super soldier. Uh, well, he doesn't say it out loud. Like he's like thinking like, well, I don't have any cork. He says that I, I'm corkless. And I was like, damn. But you're like really fast and really good. Like no normal human being can't do what you can do. Well, I just have strong reflexes and I train my body. That's it. And there's like and people are like taking pictures of him and like with his hood, the car tore and he's on the paper next day and he's like and he's like oh it's it's like it's this like the shield hero. Yeah, it's not going to be the shield hero. It's going to be Captain Japan. tell me is captain japan to cringe or captain tokyo like give me a name for deku give me a hero name so like um so yeah he's he's gonna be like that and yeah yeah he's gonna be like that and while baku uh, when well like the next day like in the evening all might comes to his like ho- window in front of his home and he like offers him or oh, one for all and is like you have the act of heroism you can do it i chose you as my successor and deku like humbly declines it is like that much amount of power nobody deserves it but i think there is a better candidate for this script i think you should give give it to baku go cuz he always admired you and he he might not look it look like but him his attitude could be cr- little bit crude but he has a strong heart of hero i think he would be an amazing hero for your core and uh, uh, all might like accepts all might says like okay deku okay me young midoriya uh, sh- young midoriya shonen i will I, i will take it into consideration and then next day like he goes to he, he goes up to like uh, like he goes up to bakugo and he offers him the one for all and bakugo accepts so yes in this version bakugo is going to get the one for all because it's my motive <laughs> yeah yeah cuz i mean i mean our boy like he's going to be like super explosive so yeah so uh, deku like uh, but deku says like well uh, i might not get your core but I ever request all might. I uh, yeah, sure sure. Young Midoriya, tell me what is your request? Would you please train me cuz I want to experience combat training and like how to be a better hero and who's the best teacher other than you? And like uh, all might blushes a little bit and he's like okay. So he like like trains Bakugo and like Deku together. like uh like like muscle training muscle build up training for bakugo and like all for all for like deku it's like combat training he like fights with bakugo and both all might like he literally becomes like a super super powerful like uh like a like like a really powerful combat hero and deku is like saying that uh, well You guys both have really super powers. All I have is like augmented strength, senses and speed and stability than other than normal human beings. I need to even out the playing field and get something get some get some kind of support open. Support uh, support gear, support weapon. And ba- and deck then all my tells him like, "Well, uh since since my since my friend dr david shill or knows about like professor abraham i don't know his last name sorry i forgot his last name his last name is really difficult to pronounce and i couldn't remember it and so he's like okay i'm going to take you to dr david shill and he goes to david shill and david shill offers him some kind of like toy some kind of like gun swords and like other 
like jet books and he's like he's going there and he goes in the back and he's like what is this shield and he's like well david chill is like well it's a vibranium shield it's just it absorbs vibration like vibration vibranium shield i would like to have this if if you're willing to give it to me mr shield and it's like well that's just a shield i mean it's not something at something that you can use to attack people subdue enemy but deku is like well i want to be the hero who will protect everyone for truth justice honor and patriotism and there's like and a hero like me should have a symbol like this a uh, symbol of like symbol of protection that's why i want to use the shield and he's like and, but, and then like De- deku is like Ugh, too cringe Ugh. and uh, all might is like no 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 young bakugo he everybody has their own conviction and i like young midoriya's conviction and mm, young midoriya might become that hero he has certainly has the mentality and deku says like well bakugo can become his hero i will become the hero of my own desire then as then he like takes on the shield and he's like oh, okay and he, then all might says let tells to midoriya that okay uh, how about you say uh, david and david says okay since it's not nobody's going to use it and i like built this for like decade ago take good care of it kid yeah this shield is yours and uh, deku gets like a chick charm and he's like he, he gets to like like he practices with the shield and stuff like how to throw it like all does the like the cap shield throwing training like falcon and, and the winter soldier like the falcon does in the falcon and winter soldier program yeah and yeah he like masters the shield technique like within the time period like like he becomes like a he he essentially becomes like a like a really really good like shield like <laughs> like shield master yeah he becomes a shield master cuz he can like over he can he he like like how the captain america shield defies the laws of physics by like i'm not quoting i'm quoting spider-man that thing doesn't obey the obey the laws of physics yeah he's gonna get op like that he, with his shield so yeah now he's gonna his training is complete and he's gonna go to the entrance exam and this is where we're gonna left off so last time in the last exams uh, or oh sorry in the not in the last exams in the last part deku just like got enrolled into like ua high and he's about to get into enroll into ua high he had his shield from david shield which is a pun cuz <laughs> come on david shield make a vibranium shield for captain japan yeah no one of like christopher you said that mm, i should call him captain japan cuz that's a cool name okay so captain japan that whose hero name is going to be captain japan and his attack name is going to be like named after like uh, like famous cities or prefectures or after like japan like kyoto slice yeah so it's just just like foreshadowing little bit or like uh mm, like tokyo smash yeah tokyo smash that's that's pretty dope name actually not going to lie yeah So yeah he's going to be like that so Deku in this what if he's going to be like uh, he's going to have cap shield and cap captain uh, like captain america's like captain america steep rogers charisma and he's also going to be like a hand to hand combat like 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 he's going to be like hand to like one of the best hand to hand combat like genius in the world ever period so he's going to be like and he's going to have like super soldier like powers too which is like pretty dope so mm, uh, so, so now we're going to go into the entrance exam in the entrance exam what deck will going to do is like he's not going to like fall cuz i mean come on captain america that guy is nimble as hell and he's not going to fall so he's not going to fall the interaction with him uraka and ida doesn't happen and he's going to like uh, 
is going through the whole like uh, entrance exam easily and like uh, the when the present mike says well now we are gonna do the entrance exam and deku just like straight up run like run and he just throws like bunch of like he throws his shield and literally cleaves through like three robots like bang 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 and they're destroyed because he destroyed their like like vital points like their heads or stuff like that and he's like and he's like like mm, he, he and the recoil of that bang 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 and like of that like tree destruction of robot the shield comes to his hand and he gets his gets the shield on his hand and he's just like going forward he's like punching kicking and like throwing his shield and destroying robot left and right and i was like well that guy gets it what are you waiting for go real heroes don't wait for time yeah yeah and you know present mike being uh, uh, like your complete like mc so everybody's go and everybody's like destroying lo- robots left and right deku destroys robots pretty damn amazingly cuz he has like captain america's shield is like frisbee of doom <laughs> it should be called the frisbee of doom because that thing is strong and powerful and that thing's can like destroy a lot of thing it, it if it can destroy like humongous tanks it can pre- and like humongous tanks the shield carrier the shield's heli carrier i mean it, it things can definitely like destroy and and i mean come on captain america's shield can even destroy like some chitauri warship they're like super powerful so this can also destroy like basic robots so uh, the whole incident with the zero point robot that happens uraka gets trapped under the rubble and in this instance i like if you have like you listen to any of my other what ifs i like to give the zero power robot some big ass laser cuz it's cool like this that robot has like a gigantic red marking which is from on his forehead so it's bound to have a big ass laser power so it's gonna like use that laser but not that big but it's gonna be big but captain america come on he has shield captain japan captain deku japan he's gonna have the shield and he's gonna like bo- like block it i mean captain america's shield he, it can block thor's like th- like mjolnir strike so it can definitely block a puny laser laser so he blocks the laser beams and the laser beams are like uh, the, and the laser beam is like reflected and destroying like various robots that was ganging up on him from other side yeah the zero point robot also can like produce like other robots like multiple one or two point like multiple 10 or 20 point robots it's my what if okay take it along with the zero point robot you get like a horde of like significantly tiny robots so what um, deck who does here he like jumps from one robot's head to another whole robot's head and he like does like a humongous jump and and like he just like jumps over like the like different parts of the zero point robots and he go, gets to the top of the zero point robots and like uh, on his sh- the shield on his back he just like uh, goes to the top of the zero point robot and he just like like uh, from the zero point robots there's like sprouting out some like machine gun and stuff like that and he blocks them like with his shield like, literally tackling them like rugby like uh, not rugby player american football player y'all <laughs> i don't watch american football that much but like uh, asian guy <laughs> i'm from asia I'm from bangladesh okay so he like like a uh, american football player or a rugby player just tackles them and like 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 bulldoes through them like a mad bull and he just like takes his like frisbee of doom and like literally cuts the head of the <laughs> zero point robot and and he jumps from the top of zero point robot landing on the ground doing a superhero pose like shield on like shield on one hand and like uh, and like on one knee and shield on the on the hand and it's like jing you know like those marble superhero poses yeah he does like that and he like slowly picks up the rubbles and like rescues uraka and present mag is like yeah 
Let the time is done. Let's wait for the result. Yay! Sorry, I love to sing. <laughs> so, couldn't rip, no, couldn't resist. So, this is what happens. And after that, like, uh, Deku, like, waits for the result. He doesn't get the highest score. I mean, come on. He is Captain America. Captain America is powerful and, like, very inspiring. But he is not, like, overkill powerful. But he's, he's, he's kind of pretty damn OP on this what if. I mean, like, given the... Like, it's essentially amalgamation of, like, Captain America, Winter Soldier, and Black Widow. Uh, yeah, so they're gonna be OP as hell. So, Deku is gonna be, like, Captain Japan, Deku, is gonna be OP as hell. He's gonna have, like, okay, instead of, like, Captain America's, like, red and blue, he's gonna have, like, a white shield with a red dot in the middle. That's perfection, like, Captain Japan, yeah, he's, uh, he's, like, Alfred is gonna be, like, white, and, like, his helmet is gonna be, like, red dish like the upper layer like it's slowly becoming red and like it's in the bottom half it's becoming wi more white captain japan hey man that's 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 epic that's i think that's cool what do you guys think um, okay so after this whole incident like deku is gonna like he, he's gonna be admitted into iwe high and aizawa is gonna like tell the uh, tell everyone like hey people let's let's get into like the uh, like let's get into the playground and we're gonna do the cork apprehension test and in this time like Deku like goes to cork apprehension test and he what he does is like uh, Aizawa throws the balls to Bakugo not the balls ball and Bakugo throws it as hard as he can and after that Deku and like everyone gets that return and Deku is like okay um, I can okay how about like um, okay, so I can throw how how I can so uh, Aizawa is like yeah you can do whatever you can and Deku like uh, like flings the ball ha like mm, hard and it goes pretty like three uh, like three three hundred meter and s sort like that and right at the time he just takes his like frisbee of doom okay, I just love saying that and he flings it as harder like getting like a running start up and he flings it towards the ball and literally the ball gets hit with the frisbee of doom and ricochets and like the frisbee of doom comes to him and the ball was like further back going into like 10 kilometers and everybody's like oh such a creative and innovative way to use your power and as I was like oh, well kid you got some you're pretty damn good and Deku like bodies every like like other tests like side to side jumps like it's good like i mean he loses with a with ida because ida is like fast because ida has engines obviously he's not gonna be, be able to beat ida on that regard but he's like pretty damn good and like after that cork apprehension test like the whole usj arc happens and like the all the nomus shigaraki kurugiri attacks and deku is like like extremely good at hand-to-hand -hand combat so it destroys like all the villains and creates a path through it it's like okay our main fight is not to take care of all the villains here our main fight is to go into there and take out the boss because he has like super, like captain america has like extremely tactical mind so like best course of action is to take out the main bad guy that way all the henchmen will be dealt with and they will lose morale so minata and suyu like and deku like like creates a path through like all the villains that are surrounding them and they just like go out of the whole watering area and they comes into the front and like the whole incident with like uh aizawa and like uh, shigaraki happens aizawa is laying down like half decaying and shigaraki is like <laughs> Where is All Might? I'm gonna kill him. Today is the day that he will die. Uh, Kurugiri, don't you think so? Kurugiri is like, yes, Master Shigaraki. You're right. Today we will die. <laughs> yes, Kurugiri. Yes, you're right. And like, 
and deku comes with his mask on and is like not if i am happening you evil villain and he throws his like frisbee of doom toward kurugiri is like uh, uh Kurugiri's like metal part and Kurugiri like didn't like notice that that's why he didn't like open a portal or stuff like that if he opened a portal he would have been saved but that like devastated Kurugiri and Kurugiri is like knocked out pretty much like he's he's knocked out with one frisbee of doom and and uh, and shigaraki is like uh, you you worthless kids uh, uh, you are cheating yeah i'm going to kill you and he comes to like uh, touch he comes to like fight and uh, deku and razor heads like if he touches you with his all five fingers and with his palm you're going to be like uh, like you're going to decay you're going to your flesh is going to rot and, and deku is like okay i understand i'm just going to have to fight him so he just like curb stomps shigaraki with his like martial art powers not touching his like not letting him touch not letting like uh, shigaraki touch any part of deku with all five fingers or or his form and he's like literally like broke shigaraki's hands two of his hands they're broken and shigaraki is like uh can't move and then he proceed to broke his shoulder and his legs so shigaraki is dead it's not de- shigaraki is like a vegetable <laughs> is shigaraki is like in a vegetated state is like ah uh, and he's cussing and moaning is like ah uh, and deku picks up his shield and is like shut up i don't like bullies and he uses his shield and like bump on his head like jing and like the frisbee of doom again knocks down and kurugiri by that time gets like uh, uh, he reawakens sometimes like maybe some villain like reawakened him and kurugiri like unleashes like five or six nomus and all might comes cuz ida goes to the teacher and the nomu is like fighting all might deku is like okay so let the big guy have the let my big shot big guy have fight the their big guy i'm going to take care of other no other villains and nomos so there are like other smaller nomos there like there is a one nomo which is like as agile like not that powerful in terms of strength but really really agile deku gets like deku takes care of them with like five shots of frisbee of doom of ricocheting like with one like Deku essentially like hitting the frisbee of doom it like hits one villain and hits another villain it's like bang 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 it's like you know like uh, like what's like that video game it's like he just like hits and it reflects ricochets and he it hits another person so he's like bodying people left and right like one hit KOing them cuz that shield is made of vibranium and vibranium is like like more like it absorbs vibration and impact so and just like like i mean if you've seen captain america you know that he just like his his shield is essentially the frisbee of doom or the boomerang a terror boomerang no it's not a boomerang it's a frisbee it's a big ass giant frisbee that is pretty powerful so he's going to like get through that and he's going to like destroy them here and there and like all the whole fight with like the higher no more and all might happens and all all might like beats the no more the way he beats in the original timeline deku like gets eyes out to his feet and everybody's like okay this is done and they're like done and so the next day uh eyes out is like hey deku come here uh we have like and deku is like okay and aiza is like gets all the heroes that are like extremely extremely talented in like hand to hand combat and like using like weapons and ma- martial arts then uh, then deku and aiza is like i i understand and i know your potential i get it i get your potential and i tried to like in the core comprehension test i tried to shut down your core but that didn't happen that much so i think for you you need to improve your hand to hand fighting work so along with me and these gentlemen and ladies you're going to learn how to fight hand to hand using your best abilities so there's going to be like gunhead aizawa 
Miracle. I don't know other like uh, martial art heroes. I don't know that much. I am an anime watcher, not much of a manga manga guy. So uh, they they like Deku learns from like seven different masters. Let's just say because seven is like a it's like a holy number in all anime and manga. Like seven whole like seven Dragon Ball, seven Deadly Sin, seven Humunculus, seven Dragon Slayer, seven 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 seven. So he's gonna. I learned seven different like pro pro heroes martial arts or fighting style pretty well and he's gonna be like a beast he's gonna like beat them all seven hand to hand like like all seven of them hand to hand with himself along with their coke he's gonna beat like all seven of them like it's seven v one and he wins so his training complete so and he gets like a big buff right before the like the like sports festival arc and in the sports festival arc like you know how Deku wins the race yeah he essentially wins the ra- race because of like he uses like one part of the robot and like mounts it like like he puts like a lot of explosion in there and he just like f- which flings them uh, flings him and like Deku in this timeline Captain Japan not Deku sorry Captain Japan <laughs> yeah he's gonna win it like that but instead of using like any different like sh- like he's gonna be up ahead anyway and he's like saying like okay these people are like gaining on me so instead of like constantly like putting a lot of them in one place and like bouncing them from using his shield he's gonna like like use his shield like okay stomp which puts him like a little bit further and he just uses like like ricochets he just like reflects like it's like the he using himself like uh, he, he using the frisbee of doom as like a platform like unbroke unbreakable like unbreakable platform to use like jump from <laughs> jump higher than he usually can I just like gets there like and Bakugo in like uh, the Todoroki they come like way way before him like they don't even like like it's like it's like five minutes later second person and third person comes and Deku like clears this race like five minutes before and in the cavalry battle is the same lineup but like like people can't like like instead of Deku and Deku is gonna be like the guy sitting on the top and he's gonna use his frisbee of doom and <laughs> with everybody trying to like capture his headband and he's gonna like fling them and they're gonna like like go like bang 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 and they're gonna be like knocked out because like he I mean I mean you're gonna be like okay he's getting the people are getting knocked out with just a frisbee well to be clear he is a super soldier and he has a lot of power super soldiers are hella strong so there's like a ton of power behind that throw and i'm gonna like red i'm gonna probably do something like that and there's like a the and like if you see the black panther movie you can see that like vibranium can absorb kinetic energy and it like releases like extremely well so Deku will have a suit like that like vibranium like full body and he's gonna be like and his frisbee of doom is gonna be more more absorbent it's gonna like absorb like more vibranium energy and like and Deku has like a trigger or like a thumb trigger or like a way to like control like with with a mechanism he can like control the like control when will the like kinetic energy will be released or not so because of that he doesn't like kill people but he can kill people if he wanted to because frisbee of doom is deadly as hell so he's gonna like going through left and right and bodying people and he wins it and he and now comes the combat portion 
like his battle with Todoroki Todoroki like blast him with like uh, ice gadgets ice gadgets or something like that like avalanches and like huge ice glaciers and Deku just like Captain America he tanks them with his suit and with his uh, like frisbee of doom and <laughs> sorry I'm gonna stop I'm gonna have to stop but it's fun to do it <laughs> So uh, he's like with his shield and he just like throws the frisbee uh, of doom. Sorry, can't help it. <laughs> now that now it just became an obsession. Now he just used his like uh, shield uh, to like uh, get through like a lot of like huge blocks of ice, and he also uses like kinetic punches, which is like kinetic energy that is stored and is like uh, he gets through it and he makes. Todoroki afraid and Todoroki uses his like fire side and ice side put together but but in this instance he's gonna use his like gig like uh, like he's gonna use his shield to tank the attack the cementos the sim like cementos will not pick world because he the when his cementos is trying to do that and Deku is like stop I can take it I can do it and he just tanks the whole attack and there's like a humongous kinetic energy built into his shield and little bit onto his suit and he's like flicking you lose Bakugo and he like creates and he like mm, like like uses his shield to like tap the floor and literally there's like a humongous kinetic energy blast and which like flings like Bakugo to the outer layer of the arena and making like Deku winning like Captain Japan wins Todoroki is beaten because of a push out a ring out with the frisbee of dooms kinetic energy <laughs> mostly but <coughs> After seeing this, Bakugo is smiling because he knows that okay, Deku is gonna be. It's not gonna be that problematic because he has like because Deku doesn't have that much kinetic energy on his shield. But boy, oh boy, Bakugo, you're gonna be beaten pretty badly. So what happens is like uh, in the final, like uh, Bakugo versus Uraka. I don't need to cover it because. Bagu wins it, Uraga does his, does her shit, but still Bagu wins it. So in the final, it's gonna be like Bagu versus uh, like Captain Japan, and Bagu like tries to like uh, use his explosion, and he uses like explosion, like he uses like Hauser impact on his face, and the suit just like tanks it, and Deku is like <laughs> Bagu, Bagu. You have a very ferocious side, which is not righteous. A hero needs to be righteous. And literally, Deku takes his shield and puts his back, and he's gonna be like, "I'm gonna beat you without using even my shield." And Bakugo tries to exp use like explosion. Deku dodges it and like counterattacks him in his gut with his punch, not using any kinetic blast. He just like literally beats the shit out of. Like Bakugo with martial art and with like hand-to-hand -hand combat and people are like, holy shit! That kid is not just all about his power and all his like frisbee of doom. Sorry for that. <laughs> I don't think I can do that. I can stop doing this. But <clears throat> that kid also is like a tremendous, like the best hand-to-hand -hand fighter ever. In all the hero society, and he just like, like he just destroys. He claps and shut downs everyone, and he becomes the winner. And like the whole uh, like uh, hero internship are and the government, because he's the government agent. Obviously, the government agent is like, you don't have to show up, show off that much. I know you're capable, but okay. So like he has like, because in the first. Like part, I told him that I told you guys that Deku is essentially a government agent. Also, it's like shield, but like with government, like with like the hero, the government, like how like uh, Hawks is. So he's gonna get through like a lot of gadgets and stuff like that from government, which is like not for like regular heroes already. <coughs> Sorry. So throughout the whole process, Deku is like becoming extremely strong. He's like. Like 
Captain America level strong if Captain America like he's not going to be able to like hold on to like Mjolnir but he's pretty strong like Captain America X Winter Soldier X with like Black Widow kind of thing and so he is like pretty damn like powerful like he will like exploit everyone's weakness and he's going to clap and shut you down no matter how is it i mean he's not like he doesn't have like that much flashy powers but he's still going to clap and shut you down so uh, the whole fight like that happens and deku is going to be like like really really strong and after that the whole like incident with like the like hosu city he shut down stain i mean come on stain you is a sword with the frisbee of doom you're going to be brutally battered he shut down stain he just like shut down stain like period like in the forest training arc muscular no matter how many time you jump you're going to be clamped with frisbee of doom and like all the metal liberation like all the like uh, stain sympathizers like the new vigo a uh, new league of villain people they're going to be clamped out too but bakugo will still get captured and like abducted and like the whole incident with like all might and like uh, like all for one fighting in the tv that will happen i don't know who gets the all for one in this what if i'm going to give it to mario cuz mario is hella strong so mario is going to be like the superman and deku is going to be like the captain america captain japan the righteous hero the leader cuz mario is like the blunt instrument he's he's smart is good but he's like captain america like captain japan like mm, creates like a like a, i mean the reason why captain america is the leader of avengers cuz he is righteous and he has like the best quality of all humanity that is a great heart the heart of a hero and deku has that so captain japan will have that so it's going to be like that so whole like uh, like overhaul arc like mirio and deku shuts him down mirio doesn't get his like cork removed cuz uh, when the bullet like overhaul shoots him with the bullet deku just uses his frisbee of doom <laughs> like his shield and like uh, the bullets gets reflected onto him and like mirio claps down like uh, like uh, overhaul and with airy and airy's help and deku is like okay i'm about to take care of her and he raises her head raises her and stop that like and the, and the like in the villain side like Shura, shigaraki is like prepping up to become the vessel for the next like for for, for like uh, he's going to be the successor of like all for one like dr ojoko is like experimenting on him and like hawks gives the intel or data to endeavor and also because of endeavor's later letters uh, like deku could like decode the code and deku shows to endeavor that yeah metal liberation army is going to attack and he's going to have to stop it and they- so essentially what happened was like uh, deku just decoded hawks message which hawks sent it to endeavor so he knew that like the metal liberation army is going to attack so before that he's going to plan a counter attack and he has like spied t- like tech t- t- like I mean, come on captain america he maybe is like righteous he is not like a uh, super intelligent like super like covert intelligence like black widow or hokai but i mean my man is still he, he is still as he still is a decent like a spy and i'm giving him that intelligence buff because it's my watchf so he's going to have like intelligence running around and he's going to like take care of and he's going to like uh, know that yeah the, the league of villain is also planning to attack so he said like so this is going to be the right time to strike guys so essentially mirio with full power all for one cuz mirio already has like full power all for one and like uh, bakugo and like uh, all might and all the other like hard hitting pro heroes is going to like suddenly going to appear when the redistro the metal liberation army is attacking the uh 
attacking the League of Villains and Gigantomachia is there. So it's gonna be like a three-way battle. I know it's gonna be a three-way. The League of Villains versus the Metal Evolution Army versus the heroes. So like I mean it's gonna be a mayhem. Like who gets to like who beats who doesn't matter. So there's gonna be like snipe. So every time a League of Villain uh, like uh, wins a battle and they like destroy so they're waiting so snipe literally snipes them because i mean come on our boy snipes he snipes he just uses his long range attacks and he snipes like he snipes like uh, shigaraki and so that way i mean it's just like works and the dr ojoku is like my plan they're all ruined no and Giganto Magia comes, master, master successor. And like, by the way, uh, in this timeline, like the original uh, like timeline, uh, Shigaraki also get like a humongous boost of his like cork. But uh, he even kills some heroes and some like Metal Liberation Army definitely kills some Metal Liberation Army. You already seen the My Villain Academia arc, so you know. So <laughs> it's essentially the heroes attack right after reader store and shigaraki is done battling so essentially they're gonna wait and see because it's like two evils are like fighting they're gonna just wait and see whoever left standing and they're gonna like deck it so that was like captain japan's plan our boy deku's plan and he like goes there like avenger style and he's just like heroes assemble yeah, I know. I mean, come on, it's Avengers Assemble, but it's like heroes assemble. And there's like from like portal, uh, no, it's not, this like heroes come from portals, heroes come from like uh, like ground up, heroes teleport there. And this like literally every hero there is. And they before that, they like interrogate the hero, like who was in the Metal Liberation Army, the one with the like the skating power. Yeah, I, 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 I don't know, I don't remember his name, but I'm gonna call him the skateboard guy, yeah, or the skater guy hero. So, yeah, the skater guy he comes and like he. he <laughs> He gets interrogated and he essentially tells gives him pretty much all the information there is so after that they just go there and they just like bust ass and like gets people done and they just do it like our boy like captain japan he takes care of giganto makia because every time giganto makia just like like punches him or like <laughs> He blocks him, blocks it with his like uh, shield up Japan and he uses like Japan like frisbee of doom and he uses like the frisbee of doom's kinetic energy and he's not gonna get like captain like how captain america got like thor summer and then game no he's not gonna be like that but what here he's gonna get here is he's gonna get like black panther suit a suit that can also absorb kinetic energy and also like it can transfer this kinetic energy into like blast like into like repulsive blast i know as like like captain america doesn't have that power but i'm giving him that power so take it so like he can like take hit from his suit like in his suit and in his shield and he can like transform this like <clears throat> can like transform this and like store this as energy and then he what he can do he can do shield thrust essentially a shield thrust when he just like goes there he just activates like a shield he just activates through his suit's ai and essentially what his suit does like like put in all the vibration there is in his like shield and on his like uniform they just like flows through his shield there's like a rip there's like a blast there's like a vibrational blast which literally like bodies gigantomachia but it doesn't like it doesn't body him like instantaneously it needs like he just hits him with like 20 times every time gigantomachia essentially gigantomachia and other like villains and other like metal liberation army uh civilians they literally supplied him with energy and kinetic energy so he's just like clamping them clamping them hard from every angle so is that and there's like mirio mirio is taking care of like uh 
like Miryu is literally taking care of like Shigaraki because Shigaraki he can use he, in order to use his cork he has to touch but Miryu can like be tangible and go through his and just Miryu is essentially pulling like a uh, <laughs> like a Obito Uchiha Aspol level shit on him like Oh, he's just gonna <laughs> like Shigaraki just can't touch him, but Shigaraki is like getting beaten the shit out of him. Like Toga twice and Redestro the ice guy. Like the ice guy is taken care of by Darby, and when uh, uh, on Darby and Endeavor, Endeavor in his like. <clears throat> My endeavor is like son i know it's you i know it's toya i know it's you toya it's time to come home and toya is like toya you say toya is dead this is Dobby. and he just uses like his humongous flame geyser and natsuo yeah and natsuo and like uh like uh and todoroki comes and shoto shoto Todoroki comes and they just like blocks him and says like brother we can be a family again please I know he has done stupid thing in the past but he's trying to change please forgive him brother we can be family especially Natsuo like attends to him and like because of seeing Natsuo after so many years because Natsuo and Toa were like really really close they like Darby just like cylinders surrenders and Darby just like okay this is this has been been long for too long gotta have to do this I gotta have to do what I have to do so <clears throat> he owns up to his mistake and he's like okay then they go they go like a family hug and there's like some people and the ice guys like oh it's a family of fire you said they just come and they just like comes and it's like Todoroki, Natsu, because Natsu has firepower, and Shota and Dabi, they all go plus ultra and they go like Pominets burn and they do like father, brother, son, like prominence run. I know it's anime, come on, it's gotta be cool, it's uh, gonna be pretty cool animated. They do that and the ice guy is like this ice guy is not getting up and the guy with like the <coughs> sorry sorry uh, I still have the fever by the way I still I had a fever that's why I didn't put up upload like that much of what if but out of fever but still have a cold so uh, the like the guy with the spectic yeah the guy who's like uh, has powers like uh, perception like you it's like pursuits people yeah he's gonna get beaten by like i mean come on who gets like he gets gonna he's gonna get beaten by baku because baku is like you dumbass and he just <laughs> goes there grabs a hold of his like head where his uh, weird helmet is he just uses like how's that impact point blank and he just like loses he just loses just so the hero wins i mean it's all because of like captain america strategy who to target and whom to target by which hero i mean there i mean i'm not gonna sugar i'm not gonna say that there is no casualty there oh there is definitely gonna be casualty but still they made it happen they do it and they just win it so this is gonna be like the series finale and where we are gonna leave off right here because this is your host and those kranti once again signing off tata saying bye bye and love you guys and another message and that is if you want to check out some other what ifs you could definitely i have them in playlist i uh, if you want some check out some what if movies there are other what if movies here too and if you want to check out my music i also make music by the way because god i have to stay sane repetitive what ifs <laughs> have a thing in your mind and i also make memes about music mostly my content is about like music and what if so whatever you fancy you can check them out in my playlist so this is your host and those kranti once again for the fir- for the last time saying signing off tata bye bye and love ya and by the way remember this sharing is caring and subscribing and see you loving me bye bye love ya